Do you want to save more money but don't know where to start? Do you feel like you have a hard time keeping track of your spending habits? If so, you're in the right place. In today's video, I'll bring you the best frugal living habits recommended by Dave Ramsey that you can start now to save you thousands of dollars. Dave Ramsey is a financial guru and basically a personal finance god that has helped millions of people with money. His books, The Total Money Makeover and Baby Steps, offer life-changing advice to get out of debt and start building wealth. So let's get started and remember to watch till the end. Number 9 is a personal favorite that has helped me save a lot of money. Number 1. Get rid of those automatic subscriptions. Everything is a subscription these days. Before you know it, these things stack up and start costing you a lot of money every month. Ask yourself, do you really need to subscribe to more than one or two streaming services at once? Are you actually going to the gym or just paying for that membership to feel better about yourself? Cut down on the subscriptions you're not using and turn off that auto-renew feature. If you find yourself missing any of the services you canceled, you can just subscribe again. Number 2. Stop eating out We're all guilty of this one, but here's some quick maths for you. If you eat out every day and spend around $13.70 a day, that's $5,000 a year spent on eating out. In fact, the average American household spends almost $3,000 a year eating outside of home. Packing a lunch and cooking more at home can help you save over $200 a month and probably makes you healthier as well. Also, you can enjoy your newfound cooking skills that you'll develop by cooking more at home. I see you, chef. Number 3. Use cash Perhaps Dave Ramsey's favorite piece of advice. Use cash to pay for most things. Cash is king even as our society becomes more cashless. There's many studies that have found that it actually hurts us to pay in cash. It's even more painful than paying in credit cards. Using cash is an effective method of preventing debt and makes us consider our buying choices. When we pay in cash, we don't have to worry about any credit card fees or interest. You pay for what you want and you enjoy your purchase instantly. Amazing, right? Number 4. Avoid credit cards so we got out all the plastic and we lit some candles and we told the kids to gather around and we had plastic surgery. <laughs> Citibank, what's in your wallet? Money. <laughs> You're weird, Dave. You don't have any credit cards? Nope. This is my wallet. Green president's faces. The best way to use a credit card is to cut it up. Dave Ramsey. This is one of Dave Ramsey's most controversial advice, but he believes credit cards are a trap and you should not be using them. If you're spending money on a credit card, then you're spending money you don't have. When you use a credit card, you're borrowing the bank's money to spend and not actually using your own cash. Before we know it, credit card debt can become a big source of stress. So the easy solution is to just not use them. Number 5. Buy generic brands. Stop buying name brands. There are some items that are generally cheaper to buy generic. So next time you're grocery shopping, try and buy the generic item for milk, juices, spices, including sugar and salt, produce, and even cooking oils. Many times, there's almost no difference in quality and your savings can add up from each grocery run. So buy generic. Stop buying name brands. Number 6. Make a budget. This one is key. You can't save money if you don't know where your money is going. Dave Ramsey recommends zero-based budgeting, where every dollar you make has a job and a purpose. This is going to show you where your money is going, so you can prioritize your spending and savings to align with your needs and values. This will also help cut back your spending in areas where you don't want your money going. Number 7. Avoid debt. Comparison will kill you. So we made the decision we're not borrowing money anymore. You're weird. You're right. Normal's broke. You know what you have if you don't have any payments? Money. Weird thing. <laughs> Monthly debt payments prevent you from saving money. So if you have debt, then you need to tackle that ASAP. Ramsey's debt snowball method is a great tool to do this. Basically, you focus on paying off your debts from the smallest amount to the largest. The small wins you get from paying off those small amounts keep you motivated to pay off the rest of your debt. Once you're debt free, your money and income is freed up and you can use that for saving and investing. And if you don't have debt, good job. Do your best to keep avoiding it. Number 8. Lower cell phone costs Take a look at your cell phone plan. Can you cut back on anything? Maybe you don't need that expensive data plan or that expensive warranty. Try to eliminate the extras in your plan that you don't use. You can also try to call your company to lower your bill 
or even switch providers. Also, skip that next phone upgrade. If your phone is still working fine, chances are you won't be missing much if you don't upgrade to the latest phone, but you will be saving a lot of money. Number 9. Use your library card. My personal favorite. Many libraries have evolved to keep up with the modern times. In addition to books, they offer digital downloads, music, audiobooks, online subscriptions, and much more. My local library even offers camping passes along with camping equipment that you can rent out. Make sure to check your local library out before hitting buy on that next purchase and you may be surprised to how much money you can save. Number 10. Sell what you don't need. You can declutter your house and make money getting rid of it? That sounds like a win-win. Most of us don't need more stuff. In fact, take a walk around your house. Look at all the stuff you don't use anymore. Take a look at your basement, your garage, or any other storage areas you may have. Sell this stuff on online marketplaces and make money while doing it. Number 11. Set up automatic savings. Set up these automatic saving contributions from your bank account so you don't have to think about moving money manually every month. It's automatic. This will also prevent you from impulse buying since the money will already be moved once you get paid. It's a surefire way to grow your money without even thinking about it. Number 12. Discounts. Every time you want to make a purchase, make sure you check for discounts. You can check flyers in the mail, online discount websites, or even use discount shopping apps to give you the best deals for your purchase. And if all else fails, just ask someone in person when buying in store or if you're at an event. You never know what's available if you don't ask. I hope you enjoyed this list of the top frugal living habits inspired by Dave Ramsey's advice. Make sure you try and implement as many of these as you can. And before you know it, you'll see your savings increase. Share in the comments below which one was your favorite. Thanks for watching. And as usual, remember to hit that like and subscribe button for more videos like these. Implement great frugal living habits and watch your money grow. Till next time.